No future can escape the hauntings of the past. Openings are forever enmeshed between nows and thens in the continuous becoming of something else. This scenario, what the world eats, agrotechnologies in earthly futures, parts from the thickness of time in imagining the entanglements between technology, agriculture, and the environment. The climate undergoes radical shifts where agricultural landscapes and local ecosystems adapt to extreme temperatures, droughts, and flooding. Modern agriculture leaves thick materializations of the past. The plantation meets the dizzy bees. In the sixth mass extinction, the disappearance of species echoes limits of the world's future variability. This proposal challenges our notions of technology and agriculture, in particular the excess of trash and toxics generated in these contemporary industries. The world is literally eating the waste chambers of packaging, plastics, and electronic trash. Canal machines instead mimic the lifespans of nature. Can technology itself become compostable for the earth? A soft symbiotic being or a form of companion planting? It's a call to nurture and express gratitude to our earthly origins and consider the impact on future generations. Key trends shape this future. From biocomputing and sensing, where technology assembles life. The rise of new materials, where organic substances like mycelium have versatile appliances for a wide range of sectors. Traditional ecological knowledges allow us to think in symbiotic relationships between many agencies, such as soil, plants, and community. In a world that ensures variability, the notion of the invasive or promotes culinary adaptions and biodiverse resilience. Visualize a world of sensible beings from plants to fungi, contributing to decision-making. Microbots and slime mold bots, soft robotics crafted from mycelium networks, navigate the intergenerational worlds of nature and technology. Culturally, Every aspect of existence is alive and expressive, and work becomes a productive collaboration between humans, non-human entities, and the organic electronic interface. The agricultural landscapes are not just fields, but cities for multi-species living, showcasing the intertwining relationships between different species.
In the background, we hear the music of the Barbanzelli pygmies and their forest home. This recording is called Women Gathering Mushrooms. Take a pause, listen. Could this provide a sonoric inspiration to future harvesting and its many collaborating actors? 